What's going on? How you doing? This is your boy, Antonio Johnson, and let me just share a couple things with you. I want to inspire you, first of all, uh, to continue to fight for what matters to you, right? You want something amazing to happen in your life, right? Something truly amazing. You want something other people don't have, right? Then that means you got to do what other people aren't willing to do. And I'm going to tell you something what most people aren't willing to do. They're not willing to take responsibility for all of the results of their attitude. Yeah, attitude is 90% of all of your success. Doesn't matter what you do and what business it is, relationship or whatever. What is your attitude about the thing, right? How do you feel about it? What are you thinking about it? Are you frustrated? Are you tired? Are you weary? Are you feeling like it's too much? All of those things affect you when it comes to your success. Now, like I said in the beginning, don't stop fighting. Fight, 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 fight. But how do you fight and win? Okay, that's what you want to know, right? How do you fight and win? You can't blame anybody. See, if you're blaming, then you can't fight. And if you're fighting, then you can't blame. You have to pick which side you're going to be on. You're either going to fight or you're going to blame. Fighters win. Blamers lose, but they always have an excuse as to why they were not able to accomplish their goals. They're always making excuses for why they were not able to achieve success. I'm trying to help somebody because you're, you've quit fighting because you're blaming. You're not fighting anymore because it's someone else's fault. You're not fighting anymore because uh, uh, something happened that's out of your control. You're not fighting anymore. And if you're not fighting, then you're not winning. He who fights a good fight always wins. So again, are you blaming or are you fighting? What's your attitude? The attitude of a fighter or the attitude of a blamer. See, let me tell you something. Whatever you're trying to do, if it's very important, if it's extremely important to you, if it's in your gut and it's an itch and it's a desire that won't go away and you still want to do it, then that means that God has already given you everything to accomplish that. You can't have a desire that God can't fulfill. I have to share that with you. Now, some people, they don't, they don't believe there's a God. They don't believe that God's help, God gives you the help to fight. But I'm going to tell you right now. Yes. A good fight has a great attitude. It has a belief in yourself. You also don't blame anymore. And you realize that. God gave you the strength and he gave you the desire for what you want to achieve. Hey, y'all have it easy.